fortune smiles on something so violent and ugly as revenge, it seems not only proof that God is on your side, you're doing his will. At a time when I knew very little about my enemies, the first name on my death list, Oren Ishii, was the easiest to find. But of course, when one manages the difficult task of becoming queen of the Tokyo underworld, one doesn't leave it a secret, does one? Oren Ishii was born on an American military base in Tokyo, Japan. The half-Japanese, half-American military breath got their first experience with death at the age of nine. At that age, she witnessed the death of her parents at the hands of Japan's most ruthless Yakuza lord, Boss Motsumoto. <clears throat> she swore revenge. Luckily for her, Boss Motsumoto was a pedophile. At 11, she got her revenge. At 20, she was one of the top female assassins in the world. At 25, she took her hand at the killing of nine innocent people, including my unborn daughter, in a small wedding chapel in El Paso, Texas. But on that day, four years ago, she made one big mistake. She didn't kill ten. All right, Ishii, you and I have unfinished business. Beatrice. Oh, your instrument is quite impressive. What was it made? Okinawa. Whom in Okinawa made you this steel? This is Hattori Hanzo steel. You lie. Caucasian girl likes to play with samurai swords. You may not be able to look like a samurai, but at least you can die like a samurai. Attack me with everything you have. <laughs> Hey! <laughs> 